Greetings and welcome, future Power Linux users. Today I'm going to be helping you with a problem that's been plaguing me for a couple of days now. I've Googled all over and haven't really found a step-by-step -step off of something so easy. Um, this has to do with my flavor of Arch Linux. In this case, it's Manjaro and my version of TeamViewer which I will show you here. This is Manjaro latest stable 2022 and this is TeamViewer 15.27.3. So as you can see here, I have a computer that I want to remote into. This is my laptop. And before the problem is fixed, I have this error on TeamViewer. Oh, let me just type in the password one more time. Black screen. Now, if you notice in my laptop, the computer is responsive and you can see that I am connected. So the problem is the, uh, the, the client, I mean, sorry, the server side, the server side, it is the server side. And um, after Googling a lot, I found some clues and the problem seems to be this right here. It says Wayland. It's the windowing system that's being used by Manjaro in this flavor of Linux. Um, it's called Wayland. So the fix is very easy and I'm, ah, I'm so sad that um, the most experienced Linux users can't give us a straight answer. They always say, Google the problem, Google the problem. And you could waste a lot of time Googling the problem when it's something so easy as one line of code. You open up your terminal, you type in sudo nano, and what you're nanoing is a file inside of etcgdm called custom.conf. The code is going to be in the link in the description so that you just copy it and paste it, open it up, open up a terminal, copy paste it, and then press enter. It'll ask you for your password. And then you're going to scroll down where it says Wayland enable false. You'll just erase this little pound symbol here. That's a comment. And then you can save your file. Once it's saved, you restart your computer, your laptop, whatever it is that you have Manjaro installed to. So I'm gonna go back to my session here that was black anyway. By the way, if you don't know how to install TeamViewer, I'm gonna link you right up here. Um, to a step-by-step -step guide on how to install TeamViewer, this latest version as of 2022, <clears throat> onto my flavor of Linux, in this case, Manjaro. Okay, so let's go back to our laptop here. Sorry about the splash screen. This is a fresh install of Linux, and that's why you're getting that little splash screen. We're gonna open up the remote, and then I'm going to go back to my client and connect to my laptop one more time. It's gonna ask me for the password. The password changes every time you reboot, so I have to retype this in. And as you can see, problem is fixed. I can see that I've connected and I can control my computer remotely. And that's it. And to the keen eye among you, you will be able to see that Wayland is no longer there, and you get the windowing system X11, which is the default on most uh, Linux operating systems. So that's it. You're set. You can reinstall on another computer and set it to be controlled remotely as well. And you shouldn't have any problems as long as you can turn off the Wayland windowing system. I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.